Mushy Mushy Peeps, it's Chris Flynn. Y'all thought I was gonna miss the first upload? Look, I got till midnight. It is probably midnight, but Pacific time, I know I'm good. Anyways, guys, today something came up, and that something was this. Woo, we out here. Yo, Mushy Mushy Peeps, I'm out here at the Nigeria versus USA game. Low key courtside, but uh, focus, focus. We out here, look at this. Why is, it, why is security like eyeballing me though? I can't film. Oh, look at DeAndre. Where's KD? KD, bro. KD, I miss you. Oh, snap. It's game time. Wait. Why are they starting? Hey dad, you know you know any of them? So my score prediction is uh I think USA is gonna win by 55. 55. Oh yeah. And they lost the tip. What's KD gonna do? Oh yeah, Mello? Hello! Look who's checking in the game. Mr. Big Pick himself. <laughs> Half time. 30, 54, it's lit. Kevin Durant shoots it, and... <laughs> oh yeah, Melo. <laughs> Things are getting a little escalated. <laughs> Yo, Melo, fucking shit. I love it. Yeah. L1, Melo! Oh. <laughs> oh. <laughs> What you saying, KD? It's over. <laughs> Wait, did I say it? Ah. Now I hope you guys enjoyed that little vlog. I know I couldn't really like go all out like I did in my Cleveland game vlog. For one, I went alone. For two, I just, I honestly wanted to experience this. Like this wasn't one of those things. I was so close. I wanted to like experience this shit. I didn't want to like go play this back on my computer. It's just one of those moments. You guys know how I take vlogging. I don't really like vlogging everything, especially if it's a new experience for me. You know, my last basketball game that I went to, I went all out. And to be honest, I kind of wish I, I embraced it more. You know, the vlog was lit, don't get me wrong. That was just because honestly, I, I it wasn't like I was dead ass close to it. You know, I, I kind of had a better view on my camera. <laughs> but this time, like I had a better view without the camera. Like the camera didn't really express how close I really was, dude. Like I was so close to Kevin Durant. All the superstars that I've watched growing up and it was it was amazing, man. And I met so many of you guys there, which was another unreal experience. And shout out to everybody that I met. I didn't think that many people knew who I was. I, I wasn't expecting that. When I go out in public, guys, a lot of the time, like, I'm just looked at just because, like, I'm tall and shit. And, like, when people ask to take a picture, it's literally just because I'm tall. But tonight really was, like, you guys knew who I was, which was different for me. I mean, given, I don't know if you guys saw my tweet, some people were just kind of, like, a lot of the times people just take the pictures because I look like I'm somebody, I guess. And they just follow the crowd. And that's kind of what happened. But that was that was kind of funny, you know. Seeing Kevin Durant, man, I just 
it hurt me. It, it really did. Like, I was shook seeing him in person. I couldn't honestly talk shit to him because I just see him, man, and he's 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 a great player. I'm not gonna front, guys. He's a great player. Although he's a traitor, I just I couldn't do it. I couldn't do it, and it was really awkward seeing Draymond just because his dick was all over my timeline. So that was kind of weird. But yeah, it was really cool. A lot of you guys were tweeting me that you saw me on TV, which was dope. Um, I had really nice seats. I was behind the Nigeria bench. That was dope. It was just a great experience. I'm so glad. I mean, yeah, it was last minute. The ticket was kind of expensive. Um, I didn't have a plug this time. And I was like, you know what? There's just some things that, although money did buy this, money can't buy it, if that makes sense. I could afford it, and I said, you know what? Why not, man? I, there's, This isn't gonna happen again for another four years, so fuck it. Today was one of those fuck it days. It was totally not planned. But anyways, guys, I'm gonna go. See you guys tomorrow. Love you. Peace.